Hey guys, it's Dr. Sharon here, and you are welcome to our channel, which is called Neat Buddy, where we take you for daily biology MCQs, so that before the NEET exam, you will be able to get a good practice and a good speed, so that you can easily crack the NEET exam. And that's what we are going to do today. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs for your practice. Before starting with the video, guys, most of you might be asking, how did you get the NEET exam? Because if you are asking, how did you get the NEET exam? Before starting with the video, guys, most of you must have heard about an academy. It's a leading platform that helps NEET aspirants prepare for the upcoming NEET exam. They have taught top educators of our country that provide their guidance and you can use their teaching expertise to crack the upcoming NEET exam. To help you out with your NEET preparation, an academy has brought a subscription saving plan where you can save up to 25% on your an academy NEET UG subscription if you buy the subscription before 19th May. And an academy is planning on a price hike on 19th May. So it's better if you subscribe to an academy's NEET UG subscription plan before 19th May. You can use our code NEEDBUDDY to get up to 25% off in your subscription plan so make use of this opportunity guys you can enroll and subscribe into the neat ug subscription plan today and save up to 25 percent in your subscription plan that's a lot for promotion guys without wasting much time let's get started question number 32 male gametes are flagellated in option a anebana option b ectocarpus option c spirogyra option d polysiphonia Male gametes are flagellated in. Correct answer is option B, ectocarpus. Question number 90. Genetic dwarfism can be overcome by gibberellin, ethylene, auxin, ABA. Correct answer is option A, gibberellins. Question number 89. The chitinous exoskeleton of arthropod is made of polymerization of option A, lipoglycan, option B, keratin sulfate and chondroitin sulfate, option C, D-glucose amine or option D, N-acetyl glucose amine. Correct answer is option D, N-acetyl glucose amine. N-acetyl glucosamine polymerize with each other to form the chitinous exoskeleton. Question number 58. An example of seed with endosperm, perisperm and caruncle is coffee, lily, castor, cotton. Example of seed with endosperm, perisperm, caruncle. Correct answer is option C that is castor. Question number 18. Manganese is required in plant cell wall formation, photolysis of water during photosynthesis, chlorophyll synthesis, nucleic acid synthesis. Manganese is required in. Correct answer is option B that is photolysis of water during photosynthesis. Question number 20. Which one of the following cellular parts is correctly described? Centrioles, site of active RNA synthesis. Ribosomes, those on chloroplast are larger, while those on cytoplasm are smaller. Lysosome, optimally active at pH of about 8.5. Thylakoids, flattened membrane sac forming grana of the chloroplast. Which of the following cellular parts is correctly described? Correct answer is option D. Thalakoids, these are the flattened membranous sac forming the grana of the chloroplast. Question number 52. Which of the following enhances or induces fusion of protoplast? Option A. Polyethylene glycol and sodium nitrate. Option B. IAA and kinate 10. Option C. IAA and gibberellin. Option D. Sodium chloride and potassium chloride. Which of the following induces fusion of protoplasts? The correct answer is option A that is polyethylene glycol or PEG and sodium trinitrate. Question number 61. The domestic sewage in large cities is processed by aerobic and then anaerobic bacteria in secondary sewage treatment plant. When treated in STPs, does not really require aeration step as the sewage contains adequate oxygen, has very high amount of suspended solids and dissolved salts, has high BOD as it contains both aerobic and anaerobic bacteria. 
domestic sewage in large cities? The correct answer is option 1. It is processed by aerobic and then anaerobic bacteria in secondary treatment in secondary treatment sewage treatment plant. Question number 92. Which one of the following cannot be used for preparation of vaccines against plague? A. Virulent live bacteria, synthetic capsular polysaccharide material, heat kill suspension of virulent bacteria, formalin inactivated suspension of virulent bacteria. The correct answer is option 3. Heat kill suspension of virulent bacteria cannot be used for preparation of vaccine against plague. Question number 37. Which is a useful product of epidermal origin? Saffron, cotton fibers, clove, jute. Product of epidermal origin. The correct answer is option B, cotton fibers. Question number 9. Which one of the following is the correct statement regarding particular psychotropic drugs specified? Option 1. Barbiturates causes relation and temporary euphoria. Option 2. Hashish causes afterthought perceptions and hallucinations. Option 3. Opium stimulates nervous system and causes hallucinations. Option 4. Morphine leads to delusions and disturbed emotion. The correct answer is option 2. Hashish causes thought perceptions and hallucinations. Question number 80. Pick up the wrong statement. Nuclear membrane is present in Monera. Cell wall is absent in Animalia. Protestra have photosynthetic and heterotrophic mode of nutrition. Some fungus are edible. Which of the following statement is wrong? The correct answer is option A is wrong. Nuclear membrane is absent in Monera, not present. Question number 59. Which of the following is not used as a biopesticide? Trichoderma herzianum, nuclear polyhedrosis virus, xanthomonas campestris, bacillus thuringiensis. Not used as a biopesticide. The correct answer is option C. Xanthomonas campestris is not used as a biopesticide. Question number 45. Which of the following are the most suitable indicator of SO2 pollution in environment? Fungi, lichen, conifers, algae. Correct answer is option B, lichens. Question number 96. Uric acid is the chief nitrogenous component of the excretory products of option A, earthworm, option B. Cockroach, option C, frog, option D, man. Uric acid is the chief nitrogenous excretory product of. The correct answer is option B, that is cockroach. So, those are the MCQs for today. I'll see you guys again tomorrow with another set of MCQs. Till then, all the best and keep working hard. Do like and share this video if you find it helpful. And if you are new out there, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.